Okay. <laughs> Start the story from the beginning. New game. Okay, I'm gonna play normal. Now, grab a snack and enjoy the strange tale of Catherine. I'm not gonna play hard just because um, it's a. I believe this is a Japanese developed game. The Japanese do make the difficult games. Plus, I think the real straight indicator of a game's different strength is in its Very important to see what they define as normal. Sky fills with glamour, a lovely story <clears throat> awaits you. Good evening. Welcome to the Golden Playhouse. Your guide for the night is me, the Midnight Venus, Trisha. Have you heard about this scary rumor? They say if you fall in a dream and don't wake up before you land, you die. In real life. Tonight's story is Catherine, an unconventional romantic horror. A man with a certain <laughs> curse has a terrifying week. Our hero in this story is Vincent Brooks, age 32. He's an earnest and kind man. But one day, we begin to see him have terrifying nightmares. On top of that, a torrent of sweet seduction swoops down upon him. Mmm. What a playboy, huh? <laughs> Will he be able to overcome all the blocks in his life? His outcome? Hmm. Depends on you, viewers. Sorry to keep you waiting. Raise the curtains. Now enjoy the show. Until we meet again. Okay, this has me kind of worried. Hey, where'd you go? Snap out of no. it! Were you even listening? Uh... Sure. You know, you've been a little out of it lately. Is everything alright? You've been spacing out left and right. Oh, sorry. I uh, had to work early this morning. <laughs> yeah. LV. Yeah, 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 one, two, three, get sucked in my sheets. Kore wa genji, so like a dream. Mazaru mitsu to no kona cream. Tsunagaru shikumi wa hen to hen. Hito to no kanke wa end to end. Gain ten to go, musu be ten to ten. Ato wa sense de kimale ume no ume. Left ka right ka ten go say you move the brick. Step up, step away, take a trick. Man, you gotta fight for your chick. Then mo mo iru kara deki nai pick. Chigan ba nai ze kyo dai. Kimi hase ba kyo dai. It's on the showtime. ビッグなハウスにビッグなカー Interesting.
up and climb. Who are you? Where is this place? Save your breath and start climbing. If you fall, you're dead. I'll die? Are you fucking serious? The bottom of the stage is falling. Use the directional buttons to move and climb. Climb one block at a time, right? How am I supposed to move these things? Press the cross button to grab the block. While holding the block, use the directional buttons to push or pull it. You can also undo your last move by pressing select. Use it to give yourself a second chance. Interesting. <laughs> to get it. It'll be worth the effort. Okay, interesting. All right, I got it. Edge. Edge. All right. Edge. All right. Don't just push blocks around without thinking about it. They'll collapse, and you can put yourself into an impossible situation. Collapse? Moving blocks around carelessly can make things more difficult for you. First, try pulling a block to make some footing. Edge. Edge. Cock. Okay, thanks for the tip. Um, this is very important, so make sure you remember this. What is it? These blocks aren't normal. They'll lock into place and support your weight, even if they're only touching by their edges. What's that supposed to mean? They connect at the edges. Even if a block has nothing directly under it, as long as it's touching an edge of another block, it won't fall down. The edges glow bluish white when making a connection. Try it for yourself. Edge. All right, I got it. Edge. 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 All right. See how the edges connect? Does it make any sense? How is it not falling? What about gravity? Don't think about it. Just use it to your advantage. They won't fall, so make stairs with them. Just get used to it. Quickly making stairs is the core of successfully scaling the tower. Use the edges to create stairways. All right, I got it. Exit is near. Hurry. Dong. Anyway, good luck. If we both make it out of here alive, we'll meet again. Hey, hey, wait a sec. Edge. All right, I got it. Edge. All right. 
door. Yeah, that's a lot of data. Get out through here. Yeah, that is an awful lot of dinging. Also, okay, I can't need to turn my mic up, don't I? Like that. Oh, shit! Thanks. I um, I really appreciate it when someone follows me. Congratulations! The underground cemetery is over. Bronze prize. Push. <laughs> the nightmare has just begun. code review meeting really no no I'm just uh, just a little under the weather no no it's okay I'll be right there yeah um, sorry are in half clothes Are you getting anything extra for this? For what? For all this overtime you're doing. Oh, uh, not this time. This time? Do you usually get overtime pay? Well, no, but... So you don't get anything? <sighs> mm. uh. Here, two sugars. Hey, Catherine. Have you ever had a dream where you died? You mean like, where you're in danger? No, no, where you actually die. You're being killed or something. No, I usually do the killing in my dreams. <laughs> <laughs> well, that sounds like you. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Hey, how many years have we been together? Huh? How many years? I'm asking you. It's just, my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Oh. She's worried about me. She knows I've got a career that keeps me busy, but... Yeah. I mean, it's easy to keep things like they are now, but... I don't know. Sometimes easy's best, right? I mean, who knows what'll happen in the future? I suppose. other news, we have more on the recent string of unexplained deaths that seem to be exclusively involving young men. Cause of death is unknown, and while police are investigating accidental causes, foul play has apparently not been ruled Hey, change it! The Chief match is on! No! Oh, two beers over here! Coming! Catherine keeps telling me how her mother is constantly calling her. She says she's not worried about it, though. Feather's totally gonna take it, right, Vinny? And what do you think? So, who are you betting on? Come on, pick one. Are you kidding? Women's wrestling? What I know. 
Sounds to me like she finally wants you to tie the knot. Uh, you think so too? What else could it be? I've known you since we were kids, but wow, you married, huh? Hey, nothing set in stone yet. Well, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? It's not that. I, mean, I love her, but I don't think we need to run out and get married. You know, it's it's like we're comfortable where we are. Are you? Yeah, that's what she said. Her job's always most important to her. You know she's always been the ambitious type, right? It doesn't mean she'll always be like that. That's not what I mean. Besides, you're single too. Hey, I'm still looking for my soulmate. <laughs> I'm not like you. I've already told my girl that I'm not interested in marrying her. What if you never meet your soulmate? Then I'll never get married. So what? That sounds just like you, Chief. What's with this voice? Anyway, did you hear about Paul? He's dead. Paul? Wait, that Paul? He's dead? Yeah, I, mean, I heard he just got divorced, but he looked healthy. It's a complete shock. What happened to him? An accident? I don't know. Apparently his mother just found him dead in his room this morning. This morning? Wait, you mean... Yeah, the mystery death on the news? That was him. Holy shit, no way! Maybe Will will wind up dead tomorrow too. Shut the hell up. Man, I hate the news. They're always trying to push their agenda for ratings. Toby, you are really easy to mess with. <laughs> Well, speaking of crazy stuff this morning, I pissed the bed for the first time since grade school. What? Oh, that's messed uh. up. <laughs> I had a really scary dream. But I don't remember what it was about. Oh, man. How old are you? 32. I know that. You know, I don't think I need to hear this. Shut up. I was really fucking scared, all right? Oh, where you guys going? Stick around. I, I don't want to go home just yet. So, why don't you have Catherine meet you here? No, I just saw her today. Besides, she'd get mad at me if I told her. Ah, jeez. What does she see in this poor fool? Sorry, but I gotta be in early tomorrow. Don't drink too much, okay? All right. Take care, Vince. See you later. His voice. How old is he? <laughs> Check your text messages and save. You could even reply to some messages. Be sure to read them when they come. When you're 20, you do not sound. Okay, what should I say? Okay, that. He's 23. He is not 23. Once words and actions change Vincent's inner ideas, a meter will be shown. Vincent's words and actions will affect the story. Remember it. Hey, how many 
dreams have we been together? Marriage, huh? I figured this would happen eventually, but just change jobs. I don't want to give her trouble. You got mail. Spam? Can you not spam my award? Her parents out of the blue? It's not like her. You got mail. Simple enough instructions. Oh, oh, and now it's late. Come on, you'll love that jazz. Well, actually, no, it's lounge music more than anything. Yeah, it's lounge music. Catherine with a C. Like my time. Ah, it's you. <laughs> what are you waiting for? Stage 2, Prison of Despair, first floor. Yes, there are sheep. Where am I? Last night's dream? Again? What the hell? I was at the bar and this girl came in and then... Damn, I can't remember. What is going on? <laughs> You're the new guy from last night? Boys. Listen, watch out for the cracked blocks. They'll break after you step on them. Really? There are several types of blocks, such as cracked blocks and heavy blocks. Whenever you see a new one, proceed with caution. You know you can hang from blocks, right? It's a really useful technique. If there's nothing to stand on when you pull a block out, you'll hang from the edge. 
If you try to move to a space without a block, you'll hang as well. Try it out. From there, you can move around. It's a useful way to maneuver. Okay. All right, I got it. All right. All right, I got it. If you can't see ahead of you, try looking around. You might find an easy path up. Use the right stick to look around. If you're stuck, take a look around before moving on. Try this one. I've obviously done that. Yeah, I've, I think I did that bit wrong. Okay, let's see if we can actually solve this little area here. Okay, let's take a look around. I can see that I might need to form some sort of staircase here. There we go. Rows of blocks can be pushed together. There's no limit to how many blocks you can move at one time. When you touch a checkpoint, you will start from there if you need to retry. If you come across one, be sure to tag it. Yeah. <laughs> 
grab. You escaped. Not bad. Silver reward. Dong. Dong. Looks like you survived. Who are you? A sheep? Do I look like a sheep? You're the sheep. Everybody hears the sheep but me. I recognize that voice. Who are you? Where the hell is this place? Wish I knew. One thing's for certain, though. If we don't run, we're going to be killed. Killed? If you see this place once, it's all over. You'll keep coming back every night. Every night? You're kidding me. We all have the same fate here. If you don't want to die, you've got to climb. So if I climb, I'll be saved? There's no guarantee. But take a look at that. See that bell? It's like a church or something. A church? If we can reach the top, there may be a way to escape. So there is a way out. Like I said, there's no guarantee. But we've got to believe. It keeps us sane. Those who panic die first. Quit with all the dying stuff. I I'll do whatever you say. Just, just help me. Look, from here on out, I'm afraid you're on your own. I'm going now. No, 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 wait. You hurry too. Hey! Can't be serious. On the landings, you can save your progress and talk with the other sheep. Go on, talk to them. Okay, I'm gonna talk to some sheep. Where am I? What's with all these damn sheep? That's all I want to know. Can you tell me anything? They told me to go up. But what's up there? Give me a break. Running. I can't die here. We'll team up to find a way out of here. I don't know you. I can't trust you. No, I'm not going with anyone. I've had it with people trying to trick me. Damn it! I'm gonna survive, even if it means kicking off others. If you get in my way, I'll kick you off too. I'll have to use that next time. You want me to teach you the technique I found? Let's do it. All right. Remember, this is my technique. Allow me to explain the pyramid. Pull out the same number of blocks as the number of steps you mean to climb up. You'll have the support you need to reach higher and higher, like a pyramid. Remember this basic technique. What you think? Thanks. Mm, I think that might be tough by itself. Consider using this one, too. Allow me to explain the slider. Pull out two blocks vertically, then slide the bottom one over. Remember this basic action, which utilizes the properties of edges. Since edges connect, you can make a stairway, even in tight spots. Genius. How was that? But you didn't know. Um. Anyway, what I want to say is this. If you're relying on luck to keep you alive, then it's all over. I know. My reporter's instincts are telling me this dangerous form of free climbing has some techniques hidden within it. There are many techniques to discover. I guess the key is to find as many as we can. All right. If you find anything, you tell me, okay? That's an order. Maybe this will be useful. Uh, uh, I don't want to die! Just calm down. Are you saying that to try to bring my guard? I'm not falling for that. Everyone's just out. Some asshole pushed me too. Next time, I'm gonna start shoving or I'll die.
Uh -huh. Welcome to the confessional. It seems a new lamb has appeared. Who are you? This is the world of nightmares. You are the lambs who have been chosen. You will all be dead soon. What? What? Don't be ridiculous. But before I kill you, I want to determine your life's worth. So, I'll have you answer my question. Damn it, what is this? Question one. Is marriage the point where life begins or ends? Pull the rope with the answer that best matches your true feelings. <laughs> oh, so that's your choice. That's surprising. Hey, who are you? Are you doing all this? No. I merely watch over the sheep. What? Someone else dropped you here. Someone in the real world wanted you to be dropped here, and wanted you to die. It's someone you know. <sighs> if you want the truth, you'll have to survive. But since you seek survival, I will take you to the next trial. Damn it, what is going on? What? This game is all kinds of weird. <laughs> that running animation. <laughs> There's still more? Commencing area two. Are you ready? Alright. <laughs> Alright, I got it. <gasps> Are you getting the hang of this? How the fuck am I supposed to Hey, don't run off ahead! Help me! Sorry, man, but I'm not going to die helping you. I've got to climb too. Oh yeah. As you climb, you'll run into strange items. Strange items? You can pick up items by touching them. Remember, you can only hold one at a time. Press the square button. Please. You probably can't hold many, but you should hang on to one, just in case. Alright. I'll take this. know but the amount you get depends on how fast you climb if you're looking to collect a lot of them keep that in mind your score is measured in enigma coins as you climb up each new step more coins will be added to your score use these coins to purchase items on the landings between stages your score is also used as a condition for unlocking additional game features the faster you climb the more bonus coins you earn if you want more coins, climb faster and aim for a high score. Okay, yeah, sorry about the lack of commentary. There's a lot of clicking through. Edge. I'm falling! Edge. Edge. Yeah! Well, I'm almost there. Edge. Crushed by a block, the game will end. Watch out for wobbling blocks. I'm 
use this. Edge. I killed him. here and there. The fighting's gonna start getting fierce. You mean the other guys climbing with me? They're in my way! They're all trying to climb, like you. This is a dog-eat-dog -dog world. There's no time for courtesy. Anyway, no matter what pops up, stay calm and keep climbing. Two creatures cannot stand on a block at the same time. Sometimes, sheep will get in your way as they try and climb to the top. To move a sheep out of your way, move up against him and shove him. All right, I got it. Edge. All right. <laughs> Okay, I've obviously done something wrong, so we start from a checkpoint. shows you how far you are from the goal. Stages vary in length, so be mindful of your progress. Alright, I got it! That's obviously a bad move.
Oh yeah, so it is. Yeah, you were right about that. It is a lot simpler if you try and take it from the other side. You survived. Impressive. Okay, that was weird. It's you. Looks like you're still alive. Is that you? You're safe too. Barely. Still. How many people died trying to come here? People? I don't... Listen. Here, you see everybody else as sheep. But all these sheep? They're really human. There's got to be some reason why we were all brought here. What reason could there be? Why do we have to suffer like this? Who knows? But, I do have an idea. An idea? Let's stop the speculation. It's just going to confuse us more. <sighs> you should think of what to do next. I'm hearing rumors of something big coming soon. You be careful now. Something big? Still, you're really getting the hang of things. There's nothing more I can teach you. Can't be true. Come on, you gotta have something you can tell me. If we're lucky, we'll meet again. Uh, hey, wait! Uh, wait. While on landings, you can learn techniques to help you climb higher. Crawling around blindly won't help you escape. There is valuable information to be found, and you can only find it here. That dang ringing noise is just going to get more and more irritating, I swear. I found this out just now. <sighs> oh, hi, does We found a landing of sorts here, so we should expect there to be other sets of stairs. Don't tell me we've got to go through this tomorrow, and the day after, and... Third time's the charm, right? <sighs> play dead. I'm not a sheep. All the sheep here are really human. Really? What? I... I just pushed two sheep a little while ago. What's with all the cubes? I don't understand any of it. What should I do? Please. You just gotta climb. Learn some techniques to get higher. Techniques? Like... Allow me to explain the tornado. If blocks are stacked all over the place, calm down and pull them out one by one. Move them aside and bring them down like a tornado. Then make a staircase and climb. Whoa! Is that how you climb? Wow! You're amazing! Oh, I think I can go on a little longer. I saw a sheep fall back. I, I can't get that scream out of my head. It won't go away. All you hear is your own death scream. You can stay here. Even this place will fall eventually. Okay, it's confession time. You're here, Lost Lamb. He'll be answering another of my questions. Alright, I've had enough of this. A man's worth can't be measured by a single question. This is the second question. Is it okay to live with your partner without ever intending to marry her? <laughs> You've made your select. I knew it! I'll answer your question this time little lost lamb. 
This entire place is an immense sanctuary. There are eight floors. This is the second night, and only the second floor. Wait, so does that mean there's an end to this? If I can get to the end, I don't have to die? Don't get your hopes up. You'll never be able to reach the pinnacle. Anyway... I shed this? techniques, I shed the tornado. I hear the sounds of your night terrors approaching. <laughs> Are you ready? I don't like that laugh. So what the hell's going on here? Also, I've already spoken to... Yeah, the red sheep um, didn't give me one. He gave me one last on the last landing, but this one he didn't give me one. But there's a different one where I got one. Okay, what? Well, how do my answers measure up with others? <laughs> okay, I am the average person so far. Stage 2, Prison of Despair, final floor. You won't escape. Uh, what? That voice. Where have I? I won't escape. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Catherine? The fists of Grudge have appeared. It's a point. Do not die. <laughs> Okay, that's bad. That's that's bad news. Now's not the time to be dead. The fists of grudge have appeared. It's a killer. Do not die. Edge. Alright. Let's get right out of this. Edge. I know. Get away. I'll take this. I found you. Edge. Love is over. Now's not the time to 
going to be dead. I made a mistake there, and that kind of just cost me that entire thing. Let's have another bash at that. Do I need? Take responsibility. Is how we do it. Don't you run? I'm safe, right? Yeah! Great escape! You survived! Congratulations! You have escaped from the prison of despair. Tradition, right? Seriously, who wants to be tied down? As long as two people are together, it's okay, right? It's supposed to be free, don't you think? Kind of surprising. Hmm? You know how it is with most girls. As soon as they're adults, all they can think about is tying the knot, right? But there are girls like you out there. <laughs> Never knew. Oh, it's not that strange, is it? Men aren't the only ones who fear being chained down. I'll remember that. Thank goodness. 
Huh? We think alike. Oh. tomorrow so I need to get home oh, oh. I had fun tonight oh, oh. you must like what you see I'm not staring you're a bad liar you taste like smoke <laughs> but I don't mind ha, you don't say This is not good. Hmm? What is it good? Well, uh, you know, hooking up after we just met. Jeez, what the hell am I saying? Hmm. Huh? Um, is this gonna be a problem? So, okay, I cheated on Catherine. This is bad. This is really, really bad. But I didn't make a move. She forced herself on me. Fuck, man. I drank way too much. <laughs> uh, would you mind not staring at me like that? It's kind of creepy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Listen, I don't want you to get the wrong idea, okay? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. Huh? No. Shh. No. So, how do you feel about me? Huh? Oh, wow, um, I can't quite explain it. Uh, I feel odd? Hmm? You see, this is my first time. Oh, wow, I can't believe it. And I am really screwing this up right now. So then, it was love at first sight? Huh? Ah! What? I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess... Sorry! I, uh, I gotta go now. I have a, um, a dentist appointment now. Dentist? Yeah, dentists get angry if you're late, too. Well, I wanted to stay with you a little longer. I guess they'll have to wait until next time. <laughs> okay, see you soon! Hey, wait! I naturally dating so this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. Ah, you know what? It just hit me. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. Hot streaks? When the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. <sighs> Crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have. I'm not like you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I going to do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. If you're going to whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. 
Well, no shit. I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pic. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <laughs> I'm so fucked. Hey, have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on, if you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, you all right, man? You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Anyway, you're way too freaked out over a one-night stand. Hey, you paying attention? Listen, man. Huh, I never saw the girl. Oh, really? I figured one of you guys told her to sit with me. Eh, uh, if this girl was cute, you'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say, because of you jerks, I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies' man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah. I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? Hmm. So, did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Oh, Erica. Okay, enough of that. So have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They say it targets cheating men and kills them. Or not. Which is it? Wait, 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 what? What exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. Who are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. My eye! Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I, I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. Let's just leave me alone. Well, well, come on, tell me about this girl. Oh, God. Apparently, she's destiny level cute. Cut that shit out. Are you kidding? Finding your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. Yo, Erica, another round over here. Coming right up! You're in trouble, right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha ha ha, shut up. I'm done fooling around. circle button to get up from your seat and walk around the bar. If you press start to open the menu, you can see hints on how to spend your time at the bar. You can change the difficulty of the nightmare stages from the config screen. Yep, he is definitely a computer programmer.
the way he walks. Okay, well, um... Okay, so I have... A little bit of stuff I need to get done. But... Thanks ever so much for uh, checking out this, uh... Sort of my first video bit of uh, playing Catherine on PS3. I will be uh, streaming some more of this and some other games including Super Monday Night Combat uh, possibly either later today or tomorrow so uh, do tune in for that. Follow me on twitch.tv forward slash Takuma Katakari uh, for uh, updates on my stream and you can catch all of the highlights from my stream at uh, youtube.com forward slash Takuma Katakari so uh, thanks ever so much for all of you watching uh, do tune in again very soon So have fun, keep gaming, thanks for watching, goodbye.